that money can't buy common sense. The troubles I seen have nothing to do with paying my rent. God must be busy, cause every time I beckon, I reckon he's helping somebody in the worst position. Probably wishing to be where I am. Well damn, who am I to be grieving? I think I'm gonna head on down the links for a drink and celebrate that I'm still breathing. Does the younger man, older woman thing work? Essence, get a clue. It's not older women who suffer from erectile dysfunction. At 62, Libby Doyle can still get that party started. And I'm not talking about the Republican Party. It's Bob who needs to pop the pill. And as for me, I'm finally divorced. Oh, and it's time to make up for lost time. Bring on the young and the scrumptious. The naked but not the dead. No pointy-headed Yodas for me. What? I'm not going to tell you who I'm dating, but let's just say I am keeping my options open. Listen to than everything else. <laughs> oh, oh, shy, shy, uh-huh. This from the woman who tied me up with her stockings last night and yelled, get it up! <laughs> Link, we need to figure out the ground rules here. Okay, uh, no three ways, too emotionally risky, and uh, no hot wax, I kilo it. I'm serious. Do we want an exclusive relationship? Yes. And if it is exclusive, what does that mean? Do we see each other every night or three times a week? No rules. No rules, just joy. Uh, Link, I just got a divorce. And, and, uh, Link, I don't know where I'm going. Oh. I don't know where we're going. Illinois for once, okay? Just once in your overly intellectual, I am woman, hear me roar. I've got an IQ larger than my bus size. And in your case, that would mean your genius life. Just live. Go with the flow. Let's just see what happens. Link, I can't. I can't do that, Link. Link. Okay, maybe I can. This is a cheap-ass tip, Congressman. How you gonna leave bitty sis for someone who might be related to Thomas Jefferson? Sweet pea, pour me another bourbon straight up. Parliamental third. Well, ceasing my nerves, are afraid. <laughs> Your nerves? Well, try being a single black woman raising a black child in the projects in a city with no brothers worth the damn, okay? Well, at least your boss isn't lost on some island in the Pacific getting his kicks from underage native boys and Lord knows what manner of local fauna. Mm. I haven't heard this much self-pity since I listened to all 10 CDs in my Billie Holiday collection. Greetings, everybody. Link, where you been? You said you was gonna be here an hour ago. I have been tiptoeing through the tulip skirt, stopping to smell the roses. <laughs> oh, well, I guess you got some from... <laughs> you know who. Hey, CC. <laughs> Whoa, you and Eleanor? Oh, hot damn. This is the biggest vicarious thrill I have had all week, man. Picturing the two of you in flagrant delight. Please do not picture us. You can't do it justice. All right, I won't. At least not out loud. 
good evening, Cecilia. You are looking splendid. Did we do something different with our apron? Oh, well, actually, I kiss my ass, Johnny. Oh, lovely offer, but no thanks. Had a good night, Johnny? Passion, thy name is Courtney. It must be nice having your wife back in your life again. Yes, I've missed her more than I knew. So is she moving back in with you? Heavens, no. A couple that lives together is doomed to divorce. Amen. So y'all spent all these years apart just to keep the marriage together, huh? Now, that is a unique approach. <laughs> Don't you see? Courtney is the most manipulative, calculating, ruthless woman I've ever met. She rocks my world. <laughs> hey, Harlan, leave it alone. <laughs> Hello, Eleanor. Hello, Link. The worst has happened, my friend. We must pray for our friend. Yo, know, you pray. I want the video. So, how was your day? Good. How was yours? Marvelous. Just marvelous. Mm. Hey. Bought you something. A present? Well, yeah, it's nothing, really. Oh, the Eensy Beensy Book of Love Poems. Yeah, it's Eensy Beensy, so you can carry it in your purse and read it anywhere. You sang Eensy Beensy. <laughs> oh, you're in love, too, John. Yes, but I'm not babbling like an adolescent schoolboy. What's next? Ootsie Pootsie, Tootsie Wootsie. Listen, Pookie. Oh, oh, God. I was thinking about making us dinner tomorrow night. <gasps> Okra. Ooh. 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 Okay, what, what am I doing wrong? I am the youngest, finest person up in this bar, and ain't nobody calling me Pookie. You know, when am I gonna get my flow on? <laughs> Where my black prince at? <laughs> Where is my, 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 oh my God. Ooh. Something is young and rotten in the state of Denmark. My, 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 my. Hello, sweetness. Oh, excuse me. Do you know this man? Obviously, Link. Wake up. Uh, Link, meet Kevin Dante Harrison. Kevin? Kevin from, 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 from the conference, Kevin? Well, I don't want to blow your skirt out, but that's what you said he did. He prefers to be called Dante. You wouldn't perchance be Dante Harrison, mm -hmm. chairman of your world entertainment? That's me. Yo, Dante, Johnny B. Good. Chairman, senior partner, good, good, good. So, Dante, what brings you to our bustling metropolis? A little joint venture with BET. Oh. And some unfinished business. Nice of you to stop by my bar. Oh, so this is your place. Mm -hmm. Cool, cool. Oh, hold up. Hold up, you must be the conservative dude Eleanor told me about. Clank, right? Oh, that's Link. Oh, my bad. Link, excuse us, please. Um, Kevin, I mean Dante, whatever. I, you know, I just love the, the In Your Face comedy hour. I mean, that show is like like the butter. It's, it's bomb. Thank you. And Thank you. Dante, there is something you need to know. No, there's something you need to know. You haunt me. I go to sleep, I see your face, I wake up, I see that ass. Dante! No, I love that ass, I worship that ass. I'm gonna build a shrine to that ass one of these days. Let's get off of my behind. Okay. Let's get on your wrist. Diamonds, rubies, and sapphires. That's over a hundred tricks worth of stone. So, you've raised your prices. Dante, this is... Stupid fly, I know. This is my Ronnie bracelet. That's handy for main bitch. Why do you do that? Why do you hide your intelligence under that street babble? Because it sells. See, white people love black street culture. Besides, when I play the thug role, the competition doesn't even see me coming. Kind of like you want to be boyfriend Bosco over there, trying to act like he's not listening to our conversation. Link is not my wannabe boyfriend. He's... Well, well your man? No, that's not what I meant. O officially. Oh, so then I've got competition. That's cool, because I'm ready to play. I'll be at the Four Seasons. Yeah, my man. Link, man. Good to meet you. Yeah. 
Oh, and get some tunes up in here, man. I feel like I'm at my Aunt Alestra's funeral parlor. <laughs> yeah, well, maybe I can arrange that for you. Link, I promise you, I did not invite him in here. Hey, Eleanor. <laughs> it's like I said this morning. You know, we just um, go with the flow. Okay. I guess your vibrator's gonna be working overtime. Oh, honey, please, that's your world, okay? I am strictly dickly. Don't do plastic. Dante looks about 25. That's a man's sexual peak year, you know. Link, how come you didn't tell that long, tall cafe ole that you are Eleanor's man? Oh, hey, Eartha, because playing the possessive, jealous lover is the best way to lose a woman. Oh, no, 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 Link. See, a woman... A woman's like a poodle. You gotta keep her on a short leash, have the treats handy. I once gave a woman a six-foot chocolate Easter bunny. She ate the whole thing. She's with me for four years. Enough! Listen, everyone, just go on with your lives, okay? Six-foot chocolate Easter bunny. That means he know we don't have lives. Tell me about that bunny. May I have a drink, please? So, where is Eleanor this evening? She's chairing a conference on delinquent teens. Using her little boyfriend Dante as a case study, huh? Ooh, I'll take two, and he is not her boyfriend yet. What are you insinuating, Johnny? Dealer will take three. I'm not insinuating, I'm telling you. Dante is rich, you're screwed. Yeah. Well, you know, Johnny, women don't always go for youth power and money over intellect, experience, and a bar. Not to mention the eensy beensy book of love poems, huh? You've never seen a 30-year-old woman marry a 60-year-old cab driver, and you never will. Oh, no. Eleanor's more likely to go for a young stud cab driver, like our Nigerian friend Winston. Hey, you'd be grateful he was deported, Link. Hey, 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 enough, okay? Just for the record, fellas, my relationship with Eleanor is just fine. Thank you very much. Oh, I I'm sure it is, Link, but, you know, just to be on the safe side, you... You might want to fatten Eleanor up a little bit. You know, feed her some grits. I mean, they get skinny, they get frisky. It's just a thought. I like this game. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yowza! What happened to Oprah's hair? Whoa, 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 that's a little loud. Are you sure we're not watching The Exorcist? It's the 19th century, Link. She just can't run up to Rite Aid and get a box of Dark and Lovely. Yeah, well, that's why that ghost is probably haunting her. It's a hairdresser back from the dead to say, Girl, them braids ain't cutting it. You look like Topsy. Okay, Link, <laughs> I will watch this movie some other time. Mm, no, 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 no. I was just starting to enjoy that. Oprah had a costume change. <laughs> Be right back. I got it. Now let the machine get a link. So that's all I called to say. Booty, booty, booty. I'm hungry for some more of your sugar. Call me, please. Some more of your sugar? Who are you talking to? No one. Come here, baby. Come here. Oh, Link, Link, you are like a Neanderthal. Mm. 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 I like it. <laughs> <laughs> and maybe, maybe new tables, you know? I, I think I want a whole new look. Mm. I know that feeling. When I got rid of my husband, I got rid of everything that reminded me of him. Mm. How long have you been divorced? I didn't divorce my husband. I killed him. <laughs> You're joking, right? <laughs> maybe. I'm looking forward to this job. I see a lot of, uh, how you say, uh, potential here. Good, good, good. So you'll come up with some sketches? Then I call you. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. <laughs> Do vizegna, Link. Do vizegna, Pierna. Da. 
Link, who is that trick? Virna. She's gonna help me redecorate. And then some. Come on, Link, you're already repainted. Yes, I fought for British racing green. And what did we end up with? Baby shit brown. Yeah, well, anyway, I'm gonna continue to revitalize. You know, mm. shake things up with no help from you. Mm. Cece, what the hell is that on your head? Well, I'm revitalizing too, Link. My friend Latrina made this for me. That was your first mistake, having your hair done by somebody named after a toilet. <laughs> Listen, Link, we, we like this place the way it is. Yeah, but young people don't. You know, I'm gonna get some live music up in here. You know, some funk? Hey! Hip-hop! With the emphasis on hip. Well, just don't be bringing in some old broken-down geezer like Hammer. Talking about Hammer! Hammer! <laughs> Give up, Link. You know, none of this is gonna make you look one day younger next to Eleanor's little boy toy. Hey, 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 this has nothing to do with Dante. Okay? I mean, this is all about... It's about getting some flavor up in here. Then could you flavor up the volume a bit? Senator Wickham's on. My fellow Mississippians, my fellow Americans, I come before you today to stand up for the truth. I want to reveal myself to you before Larry Flint does. Oh, don't take off that sarong, baby. <laughs> I am a homosexual. I knew it. <laughs> oh, Lord, I am so glad the Gipper has Alzheimer's so he cannot understand this. My oh. deepest apologies to my wife. Eunice, I'm leaving you for Congressman Mickey Puffington, who is also leaving his wife and his seat. We're here, we're queer. Get used to it. Thank you. Harlan. Harlan. There comes a time in every man's life when destiny comes calling. This time he's come calling wearing a sarong. I'm running for senator. Yes! Yeah. Hallelujah! Yeah. Hallelujah! Well, come on, my friend. We got Harlan is fine in 99 bumper stickers to order. This is good. This yeah. is good. But let me pick the campaign slogans. Harlan is fine in 99 to Nipsey Russell. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. All senator. Right. All right. Nice spot. A little old, but I kind of like this Jurassic Park flavor. Yeah, <laughs> it's a little corny, but it's all right. Master P, I am honored. Johnny B. Good. Okay. You, my friend, are in the vanguard. Capitalism, ownership, brothers moving forward. Sup, Dante? Mr. P, next time you're in town, let's do lunch. Peace. Out. Peace. <laughs> Boy, they got some crazy Negroes up in here. <laughs> you all right, Slim Good? You got a name? Slow down now, baby. You're going to be all right. I mean, can you tell? Oh, my God, SB, I love you, man. Man, your music is the bomb. For real, though, man, that necklace is the bomb, and you are the last Don, really. Oh, my God. What's up, Dante? Hey, look, y'all, it's Master Pay. <laughs> oh, my yeah. God, so why are you here in D.C.? Hello, sweetness. Oh, you gonna play me in the shade like that. There's somebody I want you to meet. Master P. <laughs> Master P, this is Eleanor Winthrop. My pleasure. Yes, I've heard of your music. And I like your theme of self-determination, but must you refer to women in the way that you do? Don't critique me, baby. I like you. I like your big mind. Your big everything. <laughs> Dante, check this out, Flair. What can I get a woman like this? Get a woman? I am not a 40-ounce, my brother. You're just as tasty, baby. <laughs> Just this taste. You see, that is what I'm talking about. You gotta treat women with respect. Donald Trump ain't no perfect gentleman, and I don't see no women squawking about him. But you've done so much. You have so many positive things to say. You know, be a role model. 
The only role America know, baby, is a bank role. And I'm all rolled up, boy. Check out Forbes, man. I've read all about you, but you can do better. So what a woman like you doing sitting in the bar, other than looking cute? Um, well, if you read a paper, you would know that I yeah, am... Right, all right, time out a second, right? Dante, you better check your woman player. <laughs> I am not his woman, and I will let everybody know when I do become somebody else's woman. Check this out, boo, but if you was my woman, the world would know about it. All right, excuse us, Pete. Uh, no, I am not done talking. Really? No, uh, I know, but just let's talk it. about us. I told you, Dante, I am seeing Link. No, 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 you said he's uh, sort of a... Uh, see, that shit ain't gonna work, because you still want me. No, I don't, and I want to give you back your bracelet. Your mouth may tell a lie, but your grand teeth time speak the truth. Your peaks are showing. Listen, Mr. Arrogance, we had our little fling. It's over. Deal. <laughs> Deal with that, Luscious. Hello. <sighs> Dante. Eleanor. Hello, Link. Um... Link, we were... I've got eyes. This is Verna. Verna Eleanor. Eleanor Verna. Isn't it ironic, Eleanor? Verna is also recently divorced. Come, my little babka. I would like to show you the back. Isn't that Master P? Who? Well, well, looks like your man's got plans of his own for the night. But you come home with Dante and let me suck on her toes. No. Thank you. <clears throat> yeah, you know, but, um, it's like black and white. You know, that's the song that I really related to. But, you know, how did you know? How did you know me? I don't. Why don't you give me a drink and we're going to talk about it, baby? Get you, you know, get your old E on and all that. <laughs> all right. Do you do it? Hello. Oh. oh, Eleanor. And what was that today? I was about to ask you the same question. Link, this is all your fault. I, I, I tried to talk to you about the nature of our relationship, but no, you want to go with the flow. Well, if your idea of going with the flow is gallivanting around with Miss Poland, well, then flow on, mister. Well, then I intend to. Oh, good. Yeah, well, Dobro Notes and Dovenzinia and, and pierogies and, and, and... Did you sleep with her? Oh, Eleanor, she is my decorator. Tell me the truth. Oh, well, that's very rich coming from you. What does that mean, Link? It means that if there's nothing going on between you and Dante, then why is he kissing you in my bar, huh? And why couldn't I answer your phone? And why is he calling you in the middle of the night? Booty, booty, booty. How do you know? Link, you were listening to my machine. How dare you? You have a wandering eye. That's what it is. And, and, and you've gotten skinny and you've gotten frisky. What are you talking about? Uh, Eleanor, I want you to commit, okay, to, to, to not kissing anyone else, especially in my bar, and, and to not taking midnight calls from every Tom, Dick, and Don. Dante, that, Eleanor, are, are you ready to say that I'm the one? May I sleep with other men? Oh, see, that's it. Oh, like, I was kidding. Forgive me, it was a terrible joke. Let's face it, Eleanor, you have no idea what you want. I do know what I want. Link, well, Link, Link, you are an incredible man. I want a man, not a child. Sometimes you don't act like it. We've waited so long. If we don't try... We'll always regret it. <laughs> you know, fantastic sex is, is not the thing that's going to make this work. I know that. Oh. And I'm not that cheap. And easy. I know. And we haven't really resolved anything. You know, you're still on probation. Can I be on probation naked? On the pool table. On the I'm gonna hate myself in the morning. I told you Eleanor would choose the person over the portfolio. For now. 
But I bet you my first month's fee as your campaign manager, that is over in two weeks. Fee? Who said I was paying you a fee? You better put some real cash down, amigo. All right. One hundred dollars. No betting on the relationship of our friends. Oh, that's despicable. That's so low. If we made it a pool, we can make the pot bigger. Come on. You get mm, it? Sign me up. Oh, please. All right. I am not interested in y'all's weak-ass pool, okay? Because once Master P and I hook up, I'm going to have me a real pool. All right? You're going to drown in your real pool. Sweet. not just stereotypical comedy. Next Sunday on Showtime. Up next, Night Vision. But first, take a look at the next Showtime 20th Century.